hey guys welcome back to the channel hope you guys are doing well in today's video as you guys can see we are gonna be completing the showdown hoselu card which is there for the ucl final we have hoselu and we have bino getting so i am gonna be getting hoselu because he's a real madrid player and i love the guy he was insane in the semi-finals against ben munich what a game and now we are gonna complete this sbc look at the stats and then put him in the squad and play a game with him and see check out his pace check out his shooting uh his dribbling all that good stuff and if he's really good and if the card 93 card and the stats that are there are true to the stats in field as well i mean on field as well or if it's just the card and it's just too overhyped or not and if real madrid win I think this card goes to a 95 rated card. So my bets are on Real Madrid. No matter what happens, Real Madrid all the way through. But I want Marco to win his UCL as well. But Tony Cruz also is retiring. I don't know. I don't know. I am in a big, big uh, not guys. But yeah, let's get this SBC done. Once I finish this SBC, we'll look at the stats and all that stuff. Right? So to complete this card, and I mean to get this card, you need to complete three SBCs, three squad builds. The first one is real madrid starting 11 which you have to put a real madrid player in and you have to keep a torch or a informed player in and you need to have a 86 rated squad while having all those uh, requirements and the second one is you need to have an inform or a team of the season player and an 87 rated squad then the final one is an 88 rated team and a player from la liga as well now i don't know if this is worth it but if if Oselo goes to 95 i would definitely say a three a three squad SBC is worth it for a 95 rated card. I'm just looking at it that way and not the 93 rated card. So, no matter what, if I think Binogidens is two squads and Hoselo is three squads, or maybe both are 3 3. I'm not sure, but yeah, let me just complete this and we'll look at the stats and stuff. Okay, we have completed this SBC and we have got Hoselo. Now you get a London 24 UCLF uh, jersey with this UCL Finals jersey home kit. I don't know how many of you guys like the kit, but it is it is okay. I, I'm not going to be using it or my alternate uh, Y3 Real Madrid jersey. But yeah, it is a good. Eh, it is good. Now let's look at his stats. First off, guys, he has five star skill move and four star weak foot. I've never seen this Donny use his skill move. I don't know how he has 5 star skill move. I've, he's just a number 9. I don't know. When I say just a number 9, he's always there in the box. Trying to get goals in with his feet or with his head. I don't know when he has used his skill move. I've not seen it. I don't know why he has 5 star skill move. I would have rather taken a 5 star weak foot. But it is what it is. You get 5 star skill move. Those who use skill move with their strikers go ahead have fun but apart from that uh i think this is a pretty decent card you know not gonna lie he's gonna have a good header on him pretty sure you can play much center forward as well spain la liga real madrid all those normal things and then looking at his pace i would suggest you guys if you use a chemistry style try to improve his pace that is where i'm actually pretty uh, a bit curious 90 pace is not bad it is really decent but uh, yeah i would increase his pace and shooting is really good 94 shooting 92 dribbling 93 physical all these stats are looking really good i don't know how he has 80 defending but that is really really good stats i mean let's just ignore the heading accuracy it is at 99 but even without that he would have at least had around 70 depending if you you know uh, do the average and check it it's actually pretty decent yes 84 interception 82 defense awareness 99 heading accuracy 96 jumping 91 stamina 96 strength and all that good stuff and dribbling as well he has 96 ball control guys 91 dribbling 96 ball control which is really good something insane with a player like this with a striker is their dribbling and their ball control which is really nice he has 96 short pass as well if you look at the passing under 87 passing he has 96 short pass which is also really really good and then coming to a shooting which is 94 shooting he has 96 finishing he has 93 short par 94 long shots as well he has uh, 96 penalties 86 volleys okay he is really good guys i am actually on paper i would definitely suggest you guys complete this squad an 86 87 and an 88 rated squad i would say so far it is looking worth it but i don't know how many of you guys out there who 
who are like into this game would suggest if it's worth it or not i'm pretty sure it, i don't know i feel it's decent uh, for what we have put and then looking at his play style pluses and play style he has finish shot chip shot he has power shot plus he has power header that is insane just for scoring alone he has three play styles and one play style plus he has power shot plus you should try it out and then under ball control he has first touch which is actually pretty cool first touch plus and then under physical he has aerial plus which is also very very nice he has trivella okay that is nice and he has these three play style for ball control now the one thing that we have to do is put him in the squad put him in his real madrid jersey and try him out in game that is the one thing that we have to do and that is the one thing that we're going to be doing right now now i am going to be putting him in my main squad this is the squad i've been playing with and you know trying to experiment how the players are and stuff i use this and i use this team uh in uh, div 5 rivals so hopefully hopefully he's good i'm going to be playing him at left center i mean left striker so hopefully he'll be good at that position i didn't see what is okay left foot it is weak foot four star weak foot for left not bad i guess now let's just play a game and see how he is in game now one more thing i forgot to tell i have not used any chemistry style on him every time we do a player review video i don't use chemistry styles on his players i just play them with their full chem and they always get these stat uh, boosts at i mean stats boosted so make sure you guys also check if it's better to not use a chemistry style or if it's better to just boost one chemistry i mean two two stats or three stats and then boost those three stats and yeah i would suggest just use them off the bat like this now look at his penalties he gets 99 penalties he gets 97 shot par he gets 99 attacking position all these things are there So make sure you guys check it out. He gets 99 shot pass as well. So yeah, I would suggest you guys you know play around with chemistry styles and see which one is best for you. Okay, we are in squad battles. Let us actually try out how this card is. This touch was not bad, you know. He has really good dribbling and ball control, guys. I would definitely say that he has definitely he has very good ball control. I'm gonna test out his penalties. Is Hoselo on the ball? Yes. I don't know how to take penalties, so I'm just gonna try my best. Is that good? I don't know. Uh, I'm gonna take it. We have a goal with Hoselo. Nice card. I definitely suggest you guys complete this card. I don't know. For me, it's a good card. Now I don't know how many of you guys would uh, complete this Hoselo card. I'm a Real Madrid maniac, guys. Like anything to do with Real Madrid or. Uh, Anything to do with Real Madrid or Manchester United, I am definitely gonna get it done. So yeah, I would definitely suggest. He has good shooting as a well. look at that shot. It was really nice. It was really nice. Osalo is a really good card, guys. I would definitely suggest using him. Look at that. He has good dribbling. He has really good pace as well. Even though it says 90, it feels like at least 91 or 92 after getting those. Uh, Player chemistry boost and apart from that is it's a really good card. He has really good shooting, crazy ball control and dribbling. I don't know. I think this card is a dub for me. Uh, let me know if anybody else is using uh, anybody else is using this card and if you guys uh, found it uh, bad or you know. Yeah, I'm actually super confused. We have looked at his uh, dribbling. We have looked at his ball control. We have looked at his uh, shooting. I, we have looked at his penalties as well. Now that is a weird angle to shoot from, but okay, we did try. Okay, his power shot is decent also. He has power shot plus, I think. It's good, guys. It's it's a good card. My verdict, I would definitely suggest you guys complete this card if you don't have a better, uh, uh, what do you say, striker. Yeah, I don't know what more to tell. Like, I don't know if you guys will be willing to do this. I would definitely suggest you guys to do this if you have the squad for it. A good card, a potential 93 to 95 upgrade also. So if he gets an upgrade, his stats are also gonna get upgraded. As of now itself, it's a really good card. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, take care, stay safe, stay motivated, and keep smiling, guys. And yeah, do check out my Twitch channel, Insta, all that good stuff. Bye bye.